Hi there, I'm Harry Huckey from EverythingOscale.com and what we're looking at right now is my latest offering in resin kits or build-up models. It represents a northeast concrete framed factory from the early 1900s. This is a new design. It's what's called a cantilevered false front and as we go around the side here you can see that it sits out six inches from the wall and hangs over the tracks and occupies airspace. The beauty is on a straight section of track it only occupies one square inch of your layout so almost anyone can incorporate this thing. Let's get a little bit closer. As you can see, you can drive a train through this thing. It's designed to clear a five and a half inch train. Now what you see here actually represents two basic kits assembled side by side. These can also be stacked vertically to make what I call a super factory. Let's get some of these roof details in the picture here. The sign is also a resin casting and comes with the basic kit. The ductwork, which you can see here, is also my proprietary molds and castings and comes with the basic kit, as does the lattice concrete wall in the front. Each one of the modules has six loading docks, so this one has a total of 12. They, the doors can be modeled opened or closed at your option. The windows are Taishis. And this is exactly as they come from the factory. The basic model includes the one-story rooftop tower plus the water tank and the concrete water tank base. It also includes one cyclone vent as you can see here. This model also incorporates a very strong interior framework and we're going to go around back and look at this. This all comes with the kit. You can also get a look at the lights in this view here and you can see that everything is braced and strengthened to prevent warpage. The module is self-contained and simply sits on top of the layout. There is no mounting necessary. The length of one kit is 19 and a half inches. What you see here is approximately 40 inches as it represents two kits. The basic building is 17 inches tall. 
and with all the rooftop accessories can be made as high as 30 inches tall which is what you see here. As you can also see the building is very detailed. It's lighted but there is so much ambient light that you really can't see the interior lights. However, um, each separate module, like I'm pointing to with my finger, can be lighted individually from the inside to make it look like only part of the factory is occupied. That's a 40 foot O scale refrigerator car so you can basically see how big the building is using that as a basis of comparison. And again, to reiterate, because of the unique design, it only occupies approximately one inch of layout. Right there is about three quarters, and that's about one quarter. So if you add both of these two together, you get approximately one inch of layout space front to back. All you need is two parallel tracks on your layout, and this thing can be used in any layout. The beauty is it looks like it's three-dimensional and actually hangs out and over extends over the track. The basic kit sells for approximately $200. We haven't exactly ascertained the value yet. It's available immediately.